What's up guys, Lifestyle Investing, where we invest based off our lifestyle to build that future lifestyle. <laughs> All right, build it. My, build myself it top. and my dad. That's We're right. building it up, dad baby. Quick question Yeah. for the guys. Definition of success. Right. And the why? What's the why? <laughs> because uh, we want to challenge you to not think of success as just making money. You know, that's you can, you can work 80 hours a week and make money and still not be loving life and still not be, you know, still not be technically successful. So that's why I want to talk about it. I want to hear, I want to challenge people's idea of what success is. Mm -hmm. I think a lot of people want to hear this too. Yeah. Actually, people are always looking for success and what is success. And unfortunately, you get it right on is that people focus on the money as being successful. But there's so many aspects in life that Mm -hmm. are really bring in success. Yeah. So what's the definition? Yeah, what's your definition? Well, well that's yeah. my <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, you know, over the years, uh, you know, I, I, I started out with goals uh, early on. And uh, back in high school, I formulated a couple of goals. And it was real simple. Uh, it was to climb every major mountain in the world. Nice. And to sail around the world. Nice. And then everything else that I was involved in was helping me to achieve the goals. Okay. And so I was able to, to accomplish quite a bit of that. And during that whole process, I was able to formulate my own personal internal definition of, definition of success. And it's a continuous journey towards the achievement of predetermined worthwhile goals. Okay. So Say that again, please. Because that's important. Yeah, Pay okay. attention. Yeah, yeah, twice. The continuous journey. And, and that's really critical because okay. success is not just um, you do one yeah. thing, you reach the goal, and you're done. Yeah. It's continual. So you wake up every day in the middle of it. It exactly. sounds like it's, a, it's three years out and that's I'm right. be sad every day and then for one half of one day I get to be happy. That's right. <laughs> yeah. And then okay. it's towards the achievement of predetermined worthwhile Man. goals. I think we can so, do a whole like week-long workshop on that one. Oh, sentence. absolutely. <laughs> so one has to really put a lot of thought yeah. into what is my goal? Is it worthwhile? And so it's predetermined. So it's just not, oh, I'm going to do this today. Right. Yeah. And so it's that continual journey of that achievement. And wow. so always I, I bring that, incorporate that, uh, try to incorporate that in everything, whether it's some kind of job related yeah. uh, issue or whatever. But mm. well, I'm feeling guilty because <laughs> like in three different areas of my life, I need to apply that, you know, because I've had great success. I've dropped almost hundred pounds, you know, I bought a house, but there's other areas of my life like defining what do I really want for my daughter and how can I help her do that? You know, setting goals around that. Mm -hmm. And work, like making money at work. Like, how do I really want to make that happen? What do I want my work life to be like? And to do that and to really predetermine and make it worthwhile, something that's not just a dollar sign, but Mm -hmm. making it so like every morning I can be excited about it. Yeah, yeah. So so true. It it challenges me. It it is a challenge. I'm challenged myself. Okay. With that same definition, I'm challenged. But mm-hmm. it gets me up every morning. It's good. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, I love yeah. that. I love that idea of the journey. Mm-hmm. Because then it's like, I'm not just waiting for the sweet by and by. <laughs> and I can have it right now. I'm successful because I took a step towards my goal. Exactly. Today. Exactly. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I think that's really the key word, journey. Yeah. The, j- just just the, the actual journey. And, and I've, I know that I've brought this up in, in a lot of our shows you know, as well when we speak, when we speak with other guests and I mean, my, my opinions are always pretty, just black and white is pretty, pretty simple. But like, if you don't really love just the day to day grind of yeah. what you're doing then just stop, just, just stop, come back to life and then just reevaluate what you really want. And then just go slow from there mm-hmm. because, yeah. cause like, you know, I, I hear it all the time, especially, especially, you know, being in sales, you know, like, Oh my gosh, I'm so stressed out. Oh my gosh, I'm waking up so early. Oh, I'm 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 working 15 hours. I'm I'm doing 200 phone calls. This and that, this and that, this and that. Well, at the end of the day, like if you're not spending enough time with your family, or you want to spend more time with your girlfriend, or if you want to shoot basketball, you know, if you want to play some Star Wars, you know, video game, then yeah. just do that. You know, just stop what you're doing because you don't like the process, you don't like the journey, you don't like the hustle, yeah. and then just go another way. That's right. You can always change direction you there's can. no problem yeah. exactly yeah reevaluate and you mentioned that reevaluate exactly yeah, that's powerful so i think that's yeah. i think that's really the key and, and then we were even um i think we, we gotta wrap up soon too but i, I want to bring up this specific part when i was telling you about uh, nico right my best friend 
So one thing he was mentioning was because he's around a lot of us that 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 are very entrepreneur spirit and like you know we like doing like a 15 hour work week because we're just like grinding and hustling and we just love that journey you know and he wanted that same thing too but that wasn't him mm -hmm. you know that wasn't his journey that he didn't like that journey mm -hmm. and it took him like four or five six years to realize that because he would see us with the same joy because we love doing this right I've been doing you know I've been up since four thirty doing. Just hustling away, yeah, and I love stuff, it. Yeah. yeah, I'm here, yeah. and I'm, I love it, yeah. right? But there's people that aren't like that. So if you don't like the journey, just reevaluate. Yeah, yeah. Just like my good dad point. Said. Good point. So yeah. hey, we're gonna wrap yeah. up. Uh, go back, listening to exactly what my dad said yeah, with that listen line. Yeah, to it. Break it down because it's powerful. Yeah. If you really, 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 really digest it, just yeah. write it down. Look at it. Look at it again. Listen to it. Apply it. Yeah. Ask oh, yourself. Yeah. You know, ask Apply yourself it. what would be a worthwhile goal. What would make you smile when you woke up? Boom! Application, guys. Success.